And here is Persia Cross with Valisiae. It's the Fragmapedium Garon Weaver, Memoria Garon Weaver. And um, yeah, look what I've done to it. I mean, it's absolutely loving the semi hydro setup. As far as I can tell, because the roots in there are astounding. When I repotted it last year, I couldn't get it out of the pot it was in without breaking the pot. Then I put it into this one. And um, I have a lot of leaf tip dieback. My guess is I over fertilized it. So I haven't fertilized it now for at least six months. A little bit of seaweed on occasions, but I've just been flushing, flushing, flushing. So I do push it and I'm not so sure if I'm doing the right thing. Suggestions are very, very welcome. I push it to at least 10 degrees Celsius minimum. And then I put it into bright shade in the summer when its location doesn't offer any shade anymore. Its original, original location is by the Cymbidium and the Maxillaria variabilis. And in the summer that area has no shade whatsoever, so I bring it in and put it into my prime real estate area, um, which is completely shaded, but bright, bright light. So I'm not entirely sure. Obviously under these circumstances it has not bloomed for me yet. I have plenty of growths though. I don't see any rot down there. The growths are coming out strong and fast. But yeah, the leaves are have blemishes on them. Maybe there's been some grazing from something. I have never detected bugs on here even though I keep looking. I have a spider that lives in here, so I don't know if he's having a little bit of a lunch with this every once in a while. I think I just over fertilized it and it's taking its toll on the plant because I was giving it the same mixture as um, all my others, you know, 300 ppm during the summer. But yeah, I haven't fertilized it for six months. So let's see what uh, this is about. Maybe Ed from Ed's Orchids will see this video. I don't know. I'd be a little bit ashamed if he did. But then again, if he has any suggestions, then that would help me get it right. My Paphiopedalums are doing fine. I don't have any leaf tip dieback. Um, of course, they're not getting as much uh, feed in the summer. I, I just uh, put like 300 in the mixture, I pour through the pot, leave it in the reservoir, but then again I flush the Paphiopedalums and this one a lot more often as well. So maybe that dilutes the mixture and maybe this one just doesn't like it. So yeah, this is my little Garen Weaver. It's not it's not a bad plant, it's just I've mistreated it. Wrong conditions, wrong fertilizing. So, I don't know if anybody who sees this has any suggestions. Hit me up and tell me what I've done wrong. And I hope to get it right this season. It was a pretty plant when I got it. So this has all happened under my watch, which I'm not too proud of. Oh well. Let me know, okay? I would really appreciate it. Let me know. Thank you so much for watching. And if you are commenting, I appreciate that very much as well. So, I hope I'll see you next time again. Stay safe in the meantime. Bye.